Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. So here's my green smoky eye that I created using my LA Girl. My LA Girl Artistry Palette. If you guys want to see how I got this look, please keep on watching. Don't forget to follow me on social media. Like, comment, and subscribe. Share with a friend. You guys be safe during this shelter in place, during this quarantine. Make sure you wash your hands and, you know, cover your cloth and stay six feet away. But yeah, stay tuned if you want to see how I got this look. And then I also have a collab video coming up on Friday. <coughs> Alright, let's get started. So I'm going to take this brown shade here with an angled brush and I'm going to blend that below my brow bone. And this brush is from Luxie. It's an angle brush. Next, I'm gonna take this orangey shade here using my Glamour Dolls blending brush and I'm gonna blend that directly below. Kind of towards down towards my crease a little bit. And I'm greasing my hair while I'm doing this voiceover, so bear with me. And I'm just gonna go back into that brown and make sure everything's nice and blended. Now I'm going to use a small blending brush, crease brush, use that black, pack it onto my outer V, and I'm going to blend that into my crease. Again, I really love these palettes. The colors are very pigmented. They blend really well. They last all day, so I don't have any complaints. Next I'm going to take this green shade. I believe I sprayed my brush. I don't really remember if I did or not, and I'm just going to pack that onto my lid. Normally I put glitter in my, grease, in my crease because I love glitter, but today I wanted to do more of a smoky eye, so I didn't. Which is kind of awkward for me not having some type of glitter somewhere, even if it's just lining my wing liner. So I'm going to go back up to all those colors that I used previously. Make sure everything is nice and blended and no colors got lost. Next, I'm going to take my go-to eyeliner, Starlet Studio Stars Align Liner, and use that for my wing. Yeah, I'm end up having to wash my hair because I normally get my hair done at the shop, but with this shelter in place, shift, we don't want nobody working at the shop, so. I ordered the shampoo that she told me to get online and it's going to take me all day really to do my hair. Next I'm going to take my LA Girl Super Shock I think eyeliner in black, neon or gel glide whatever but it's from LA Girl and it's a gel and then I'm going to take that same green shade to smoke out my lower lash line. It's kind of hard to read the little pencil what the writing says but it's from LA Girl Cosmetics. Now I'm going to comb on my lashes like I always do before applying mascara. I'm not a big fan of this but this is the Tarte Cosmetics Big Ego. It doesn't really like define my lashes and make them look, look more fuller like other mascaras do. And I feel like I have to work a little harder when I'm um, using it to make sure that, you know, it looks like I'm wearing mascara. So I think I'm gonna go back to my NYX on the rise. I got this in a BoxyCharm box. Just started using it like last week, so I forgot I had it. So I said, why not, you know, give it a try? And I don't care for it. Now I'm going to comb my lashes again, make sure I don't have any clumps or anything like that. Next I'm going to highlight my brow bone.
and I'm going to highlight the inner part of my eye. Using this shade right here. Now I'm going to spray my face using my Milani, I'm sorry, Maybelline Lasting Fix Steady Spray and spray my face. No, I use Milani, I'm tripping. And there you have it guys, here's the completed look. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. And see, I bit my lip here while I was sleeping. So, I ended up wiping my lipstick off because it stung. Like I bit myself twice in the same spot and it actually opened up. So I'm just using this lipstick here. I forgot what it was called because I wasn't looking at the clip, but I'm sure you guys saw the name. But it's Wet n Wild with the cat suit. And the color will be in my description box if you really want to know what shade it is. But immediately after I put this on my lips, I had to wipe it off because it stung when I wiped my lips together. It took about uh, three days for it to go away. For it to go away, but here's the completed look. I appreciate you guys' support. Thank you so much for watching my video. Stay tuned for my makeup collab that will be uploading on Friday. You guys stay safe. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.